as i told you earlier we have a surprise for you that's being dated close to 16th century this kottayam cheriyapalli it's been built on 1579 that's close to 434 years from now this is the most ancient church around over here so we'll just try to get inside and know what specialties have been uh, are over there and how this church was built and what's the most important things and all so let's take a tour of kottayam cheriyapalli that's been built in 1579 yes so let's enter as you can see there's a vast garden type over here lot of roses flowers and all when i'm standing over here i can feel like all those all those yester years coming in because i'm really proud i'm standing on a soil that been invented or that been discovered in 1579 the church over here there's a gopuram over here looks like it's a newly built now we'll try to enter inside the church and see what's inside the first thing that we notice especially the architecture really it dates back you can see a similar type on the temples that are around kerala anywhere so this is the main entrance we got into uh, in through the side entrance because it's closed for the time being it's open only for the devotees during the church hours as you can see all the pillars that we can, that we see over here resembles all the old palace type of pillars these are the real original pillars they have been preserved very well and you can see all especially the carvings on the entrance idin engena irunnu cheta idinte history nu parayao idu nu parayana idu ipo 437 vella alle ha 437 vella thalo ayi parakkarunnu rajakumarada kaalathai ee palli paniyunnu ha thalile ha 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 anna avare anuvadam padichondu ipo aadhiyam njangal ivada velli velli ennu parayana ornu undu ha nanayakarade ha adha anna avadi irunnu ellarum koodi kondirunnu avaru aadu oru yakkachakkal undaakiyaanu ivada palli paniyanulla saahijaram undaagunnu So that's how this uh, church came into being. Earlier there was a villa palli over there. On our way, it's it's over there. And then they had some disputes, and they changed on to this one. Uh, some of the devotees they uh, they were brought over here, and they started praying over here. They took special permission from the rulers at that time and built this church. All the replicas that you see over here, I like. Uh, they are like they have some representation through Bible. So we get inside. the doors especially that we see over here i had seen these type of doors especially on the palaces around maybe in the shivaji palaces and all i have seen exact rep replica of this definitely those carpenters are they had these kind of ideas that's why you can see heavy door Chedale. These are all the replicas, the biblical representations you can see over here. If you can zoom in over here, all the paintings, these are untouched. As you can see, I am not allowed to touch. Nobody is allowed to touch. Actually, we should preserve these kind of paintings. 
Now the same paintings, they have done nothing over here. Only the painting of Mother Mary has been touched up because it maybe it lost some of its texture. Else, all the paintings are same that has been done in 1579. So that's it. As they opened it especially for us. look on the main structure of the church see how beautifully carved it has been if you look at the sim symbols everything wow so old structures we can we can't imagine like how much old the belief is if it goes to close to 434 years old so we can believe like how people were at the time like close to 434 years they didn't have all these kind of modern machineries or equipment still they made these kind of marvelous structures all we have to do is to preserve them and the committee over here they are doing it very well as you can see around so that was Kottayam Cheriyapalli built in 1579 so viewers as you can see even the border walls that they created so smooth and all we can find the same structure in old uh, Hindu temples in old Muslim uh, mosques and all because at that time Religion was not so important, people were important, craftsmanship was important, not like these days where we are fighting over religion and all. At that time, they had a great influence on, uh, on the church, on the mosque, because we had Hinduism religion ruling over here and Hinduism culture has somehow influenced or somehow been carried on to making all these structures and all. This is the main entrance of Kottayam Charyapalli. So, viewers, as we came out of the church, uh, we went inside and no, I, I, I sincerely think no other channel has gone so deep inside the church especially we saw the original paintings that were done in 1579. So this is your host Girish signing off. See you next week with a more adventurous journey. Till then have fun, take care, love you all.